how to mint nfts on object quick and easy hi guys welcome back today i'm giving you a tutorial on how to mint your tezos nft on object.com so let's get started first what you have to do is you guys will simply go to object.com which is spelled objkt.com and you will land on this platform right here object is nft marketplace where you can buy and sell nfts on tezos it is one of the most famous tezos nft marketplace and it has all the famous nft collections here and i'll show you how you can mint your nfts here as well when it comes to object you just have to connect your wallet and then you will be able to mint your nfts when it comes to nfts you can mint nfts as you know photography generative art abstract illustrations gifs monochromes collage glitch art sculptures ai art 3d pixel art music painting street art trash art poetry architecture and photogrammetry so you can actually mint nft in any of the different niches and you can create your collection so let's start with the process once you are on object you have to connect your wallet simply click on this sync option given and now it will open up the preferred wallet option for you here we have browser extension wallets where we have spire and temple wallet desktop and web wallets so we have galleon kukai wallet and umami in mobile wallets we have airgap wallet and autonomy so you just have to select the one that you already have or you have created so i'm going to go with a browser extension wallet which is a spire if you do not have spire you can just go to chrome.google.com extensions and get to spire and click on add to chrome you can see i already have added it to chrome that is why it says remove from chrome it is a tezos wallet that we can get and we will be able to buy and sell nfts with this wallet click on add to chrome and it will be added as an extension let me show you this is what it looks like first you have to pair your wallet with spire you can create and connect your wallet that you already have or you can also pair your ledger if you want to go you can enable the developer mode and set up a local secret once you have added all the details right here and you have paired your wallet you're good to go now we have a tezos wallet so i'm gonna select spire from here and it will open it up for me so i will just connect it once the wallet is connected then you will be able to find your profile right here and then we have our notification and wallet option given so i will just simply go to create and it will take me to this window this is where we create our own collection and we also have the token option so first you will create a collection and then you can create tokens in it all the collections are going to be nft of course and tokens as well to create a new collection, we have to upload a collection image. Type supported is max uh, like JPG, PNG, and the maximum file can be 1 MB. This is where you will upload an image. Then you have to give your, you know, collection any name. Whatever name you have for your collection, you can just add it right here. Then you have collection type so you can actually mint any type of nft on object as i showed you we can you know mint music nfts we have art nfts pixel art so for now i'm gonna select art here and then we have the description so this is where you will add the description for your collection that you're creating on object keep in mind creating a collection will cost you around one tezos in transaction fee and will originate your own contract so this is going to be your fee keep that in mind one tezos click on create and your new collection will be created on object let me show you what a collection looks like you can see there are different hot collections here and this is what a collection looks like so i'm just going to open up one of these let's go with this one once you create a collection on object this is the image that we uploaded this is the title this is the description that we have then we have items and total volume and 24 hour volume honors for sale and floor price so this is the collection right here which looks pretty impressive you can see recently listed and then we have recently sold and latest mints when you mint an nft on object this is what it looks like and let me show you what what are the different details that you need to add 
So while minting an NFT on object.com, you have to enter the description, select the collection that you have created and enter an amount. On object, we sell NFTs in Tezos and this one is for 800 uh, Tezos right here. This is the description. We can also add different auctions if we want and this is where you will add the properties. Now properties help with the rarity of an NFT and how rare an NFT can be. We can also, uh, you know, simply add an auction and add a value to any of the NFTs. Then we will be able to see all of the owner information. So these are the details you will also add while minting an NFT on object. We can also create different tags and the creator plays an important role when it comes to creating NFTs on object. Uh, let's compare it to OpenSea for a second and on OpenSea when we mint an NFT, we just mint it, we create a collection and then the creator is the NFT itself and the collection itself has more value than the creator. On object, creator is also valued as much as the NFT and you will be able to find them right here and you can search NFTs with creator. So let me actually show you the open marketplace. If you do not want to create a collection, you can also mint NFT on the open market that we have on object. So if I go to discover now, here I will be able to see an open marketplace where we can buy NFTs and where we can mint our NFTs. So let me show you how it looks like and what are the different features we have. Here on object.com, you can see we have tokens, collections, users and previously featured. So I have opened up the tokens and you can see we can filter our search with collection, tags, mime type and then we have price we can also add our budget and attributes so this is how we simply you know filter our search and you can see the art is pretty impressive on object if you're thinking what kind of art you can mint on object well any kind of art can be minted if you have pixel nfts if you have pictures if you have your own photography if you have 3d art you can mint any kind of nft on object and create your own collection as well so you can see this is the art and if we talk about the pricing you can add pricing of your choice you can add three tezos you can add one tezo zero hundred thousand it totally depends on you so make sure to add the price while minting your nft and this way you will be able to sell your tezos nft and make money we can also filter our search for the you know recently listed high to low low to high price and oldest make sure that you have a tezos wallet and i showed you how to get one you can also actually switch to a darker mode if you prefer one and then you will create your own nft so it's really easy just simply go to optic.com connect your wallet which should be a tezos wallet and after that you can just go to the once you connect you will get the option right here and you will just click on create collection and you will be able to create tokens and collections on object.com very easily this way you will be able to get famous and maybe your collection will land in the top you know hot collections and you will be able to get famous and sell your nfts on object which are on tezos blockchain i hope that i was a big help to you guys don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to the youtube channel